if you hear music in the background it's because we have a disco nearby open open air disco so just fyi and let's talk about adolescent brains because those people who don't know mature love yes we do personal development self-help here for the people who want to become emotionally mature and mentally mature move into their prefrontal cortex people who are healing trauma there's a lot of different ways that we talk about it but for now the gist of it is what is love and love is when you have a differentiated self so you have healthy self-worth you know how to just be yourself but you feel it so you love all eight billion and growing because you know that humans are humans and personality disorders are not anything to do with stories but instead you know that it's everything to do with person's childhood so when i see buzzwords trending topics the mantles mantle people would be all teenagers you see them putting posts for example one that i saw is uh, how i left my husband this is for the mono amory community who doesn't know how to talk about either polyamory or just you know decently say oh i'm gonna leave you because so the whole cheating thing and, and this meme or this short is basically where this human being i don't know woman man i'm not sure they but they i think it's husband for sure and it's you tried to hide it i caught you cheating and i'm thinking wow you know that sounds and looks very juvenile meaning like an adolescent and then i think oh that's right the people who don't mature emotionally they don't grow out of their 16 year old because they're in their fight response that last charge state i'm attachment trauma informed but i'm also woo woo lady because i'm a 5d mystic 5d because i don't have an elsa mantle i have integration of the brain and i know jesus so i know unconditional love and that's why christ consciousness that matches with oneness and not stories again of divides and splits and stuff like that so split let's talk about split for borderline or narcissists because i follow dr daniel fox but also people who are healing from narcissism and borderline and that's because personality disorders are not a disease and the gene word that is used is very in-depth now i know the in-depth but i'm not going to explain it all because i also forget the order and there are better people that can explain it so i'm just going to be a person saying i love people and i love seeing that we have humans that don't do bullshit shorts like oh let me be a teenager like on mean girls and be a teen that this is why i think a teenager is the only time i ever met people doing spiteful things and be jealous and then i grew up now that i'm a grown-up i personally don't have unhealthy self-worth i know how to love myself first and so i'm with people who are authentic transparent and if they're cuscos i just know where their cusco lies if you will because you know you meet people in time you don't kick out anybody from the herd we have sid diego and manny so we are a guitar string and then there's another guitar string and one that vibes that enlightenment because there's no laundry here there's emotions here i can be near anyone if they look like eeyore they're in the eeyore energy not the other way around which is also why we don't have sagas with our twin flames or soulmates or any of that saga stuff okay so love is when you can basically be a human who says wow decency totally i am not a flat earther but i am a mystic that's why i was saying woo, woo is good pseudoscience again human spiritual and spirituality elements those are subject matters for people who want to do personal development self-help and then be able to not only be amazing lovers because you know emotionally maturity is a really nice thing so you don't do again this adolescent stuff and on that note you know the novelty that people seek i'm also an online marketer is also adrenaline from an adolescent so they might use all the brain information because i've seen them your brain's going to get addicted to did it so they give you this way of limiting i will give you something different i learned how to do everything i did to bring my brain into my prefrontal organically by myself but i have to say i'm lucky because i got a twin and i got a mom who gave me a child-centric environment so i'm lucky because i have a whole self and it didn't split or break up or feel ashamed there's no shame so lucky again i know how to use my brain because it didn't get disrupted in the first year of life the right mode developed effectively and the left mode and then they became friends because i did the inner growth mindset that i get to share with you main modules are on the main website for free so that you can check it out and put it into practice and then the extended version of the course is well that's to be continued but beginners is on udemy intermediate advanced i still need to get them on udemy that is to come 
Okay, so love is when you can decently treat anyone, by the way, and in fact, that's what anybody like me, a 5D mystic in the Enlightenment Soul Age will do, which is why when somebody comes to us with the mantles and says people are evil energy vampires, dark auras, they want to cut cords, or somebody's doing some magic spell, we're like, ah, no, I know what you're talking about, but no, I can send you to 4D people if you want, because they believe in all this stuff. I know we're one big ball of energy, and I know... My left mode knows for a fact that there's facts behind it. It's not based on my emotional preference. Of course, nobody likes to be lied to. Oh, I was cheated on in my teenager years, and I told my boyfriend, don't think I'm going to come check on you or treat you like some piece of shit. You made a choice. This is not, I'm not going to be hanging something over your head. So the part of when a person reprimands somebody in such a way, I mean, I get it. I'm polyamory, but still, wow, like really? the envy jealousy revenge what is it this is revenge it's calling i'm gonna make fun of something in a certain way which i mean again we have human suffering love they decide to stay in their reptilian nervous system it's not because they're reptiles it's because they're in fight flight fright freeze flop drop this is what happens with attachment trauma courses when you care about helping people to be their authentic self and you find out wow if they save their zero one year old and three-year-old and get out of the shame button they're gonna have a good time until then, they're going to be a teenager who does something like, again, this short, which is, wow, that's insensitive. But then again, I'm sure some people agree with you, like I saw some other thing, and, and, and that's where I don't laugh. I mean, there are things I laugh at because automatically you're laughing, but then I'm like, wow, that's dumbing down humanity. I know they can do way more than that because I learned all about how a person can work with their mindset, anyone. Personality disorders are healable, but that's where the people who are doing the work. So let me get to that one. They need people who have healthy self-worth and who don't stigmatize them, dehumanize them, and do shitty, envious, jealous, low self-esteem, reptilian nervous system stuff like what I was describing. Because again, it's for the group of people who are like, how dare she say that yoga don't bring no demons out? I know for, no, you don't. You actually don't because see, there's no demon that comes out of you, but there is an art trauma charges now if you don't want to be a flat earther you're not going to say i find it hard to believe you're going to say okay where'd you learn it i learned it from peter levine thank you that we have trauma charges and memory and stuff like that stored in our bones our tissues and our muscles i learned from bezel van der Kolk too that we keep the score all oh, my somatic therapists I, I learned from a lot of people and the mind keeps account so you can heal is also what i know janina fisher Thank you. Your behavior, you're not a pathology. We can understand it. And Dr. Daniel Fox, come on over. You can work with the split and black and white thinking, but it's really challenging. So one, motivation, and two, people that are aware of who you are and how things are going, who you are, use your name, but that you're working with something and then they work with you. And that's what love is. Love is maturely, of course, I will understand what you're dealing with once you've explained it to me and then we choose together because see, a good therapist for anyone who is healing with a good therapist, they're going to say, okay, let's uh, all come together as a family and chit chat about how we can get out of this dysregulated nervous system, how we can work with split borderline, what to expect, what not to expect. See, this is a plan. So we, like we have a plan, but it's not a plan where if we break it, we're like, ah, you're out. No. It's, okay, here's what we can expect to be working with and how we can work with triggers that are very big. So for me, I don't have, I'm, I even with my panic attacks, I don't, I don't get offline. But I, again, saw and see human beings explaining what split thinking is and black and white thinking. And it is really something I have no idea how I would handle it because I can completely understand thanks to being it described that it's like real. Okay, this is why the whole your emotions and thoughts are not irrefutable facts as we discussed recently. For me, it's like, well, duh, some people it's not duh. But when they're doing good therapy, they know what's happening and that's why the people involved in those relationships, all of us, friends, lovers, family, parents, all of it. It's why it all works together and that's why with IHP, we learn about mature love and not adolescent. Anything low self-esteem is not here. This is for the people who want to be in buzzwords and with mantles. They think they're superheroes fighting supervillains. I see humans, not villains. So, you know, when people want a story, they have a story. When they want to inspire their infinite higher human potential consciousness and live their authentic self and live 5D amazing relationships. And so be the kind generous loving person you can be and move beyond and out of things that are from our ancestors times to be continued in the meantime for love come on over 
because it's always nice to have more people who want to love people and to bring smiles to each other and out there and our lovely secure attachment relationships. Tune in for more.